Dear students, welcome to Learn to Live. This video is based on the topic Instrumentation of UV Visible Spectrometer. Let us see what are the basic components of UV Visible Spectrometer. The basic components are a light source, a monochromator which is a prism or grating, a sample, a reference, and lastly a detector and sometimes a recorder also. These are the five basic components of a UV visible spectrometer. Now let us draw the schematic diagram of UV visible spectrometer. There are two light sources, light source UV and light source visible. Then we have a mirror, let's call it as mirror 1. Next we have slit. After the slit we have a diffraction grating. After the diffraction grating, we have slit 2. After slit 2, we have a filter. After the filter, we have mirror 2, a half mirror, mirror 3 and mirror 4. Then we have a sample cuvette and a reference cuvette. After each cuvette, we have one lens each. Let's mark it as lens 1 and lens 2. After the lenses, we have two detectors, detector 1 and detector 2. Intensity of light at a detector 1 is denoted by I0 whereas intensity of light at detector 2 is denoted by I. Let us see how it works. The light beams from light source UV and light source visible hits the mirror 1. The mirror 1 reflects the light beam and passes it to diffraction grating through slit 1. The diffraction grating reflects the light to mirror 2 through slit 2 and the filter. At mirror 2, the light is again reflected to the half mirror. At the half mirror, a part of the light is reflected to mirror 3 and the remaining is refracted to mirror 4. The mirror 4 reflects the light beam towards the detector 1 through reference cuvette and lens 1. As this beam is passing through the reference cuvette, it is called reference beam. Now, at the mirror 3, the light is reflected to detector 2 through sample cuvette and lens 2. The light beam received at detector 2 is passing through the sample cuvette, so it is called sample beam. The intensity of reference beam and sample beam is compared to understand the sample. In this method, UV visible light is split into two equal beams. One is passed through the sample, which is called the sample beam, whereas the other, the reference beam is passed through the reference. Using a suitable solvent like water, a very dilute solution of sample is prepared and taken in a transparent cuvette. It is represented in the figure as a brown box. Pure solvent is taken in another similar transparent cuvette. It is represented as green box. The intensity of light at detector 1 I0 and intensity of light at detector 2 I is compared. If the sample doesn't absorb the beam at a particular wavelength, we will get I is equal to I0. If the sample does absorb the beam at a particular wavelength, we will get I less than I0. So students, this is the end of this video. Do subscribe, like and share this channel. Press the bell icon to get instant notifications.